the night of November 7, the wind is not that strong yet. And um, the rainfall is not too heavy yet. And then, when 6.30 comes, the signal, cell phone signal, ran out. It, it was lost. And then, the signal from the radio also get lost. Before the heavy rain falls, we hear a very strong wind. It's like we all get deaf. Like the heavy pressure from the wind gets in our ears. What I just can do is hold my child so tight because I get afraid. And then whenever the wind blows, I said, Tama na. Stop. Please stop it. We trembled with fear. I even cried because I was afraid of what is happening. They say, what's the time? Um, it's already 8 o'clock. It will stop. It will stop. It, it's nearly end. But then still it comes. It, it, it gets getting stronger. And all we do is really hold on tight. When I went outside to see our, our barangay, our community being like this, our place is really different from what it is today. To those people who are victims by Glenda, we have to be strong. We should find good in every tragedy because that's our only hope so that we can move on. It's part of a bad memory and we hope we hope it won't happen again to our place, to other people. To anyone else, on behalf of the people who were were victims of the typhoon Yolanda, we want to thank every one of you who helped us, who donated to help us, because we really need such help.